you for joining us, ladies and gentlemen. These fans are about ready to tear this roof off, so we better get going quick. Make sure you don't go anywhere, because the legendary WWE action is coming up next. Guys, we're getting the night started with an amazing matchup here. You're absolutely right, Cole. In fact, I don't think there's a better way to start this night than with this match right here. And I'd add that he certainly has his work cut out for him here tonight. Would you agree, Byron? Yeah, this isn't going to be easy for him, that's for sure. But he knew that when he signed up for this match. And his opponent, weighing in at 206 pounds, Alistair Black. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. Tell me, Corey, do you like his chances here tonight? Well, it's hard to beat a person who never gives up. And I can tell you that he has absolutely no quit in him. So, yes. Yes, I do like his chances. This is it, fellas. We're ready to get this thing started. Oh, man, this is going to be great. I don't know about you guys, but I don't think I've ever heard this Uniondale crowd more excited for a match. A brutal clothesline catch just destroying the leg here. Looks to me like taking out the leg was the plan right from the opening bell. What's your analysis on Aleister Black? What kind of attack, what kind of tactics are going to help him here tonight? Well, if history is any indication of which way this one will go, I'd say everyone is in for a great match.
A move like that is completely unnecessary, unless you want to degrade your opposition, of course. Abuses him with an elbow. Two. Got it. Michael, oh, what disrespect. This one's over by way of disqualification. Making her way to the ring from Staten Island, New York, the women's champion, the princess of Staten Island, Carmella. And Corey, this woman is no stranger to winning big time matches. You're absolutely right, Cole. For some reason, Carmella can get overlooked at times, but the truth is she's right up there with the best. Corey. I would say that these women look more than ready to get this match underway. So am I, Cole. In fact, I've been looking forward to this one ever since it got announced. From San Diego, California, Maya Jacks. Guys, what better way to start the night off than with this one? I can't think of a better match to kick the night off, Michael. In fact, we haven't even gotten started yet, and I can assure you that this will be a tough match to follow. Corey, in terms of raw talent, where do you think these women rank as it relates to the other competitors in the division? Oh, they're right there at the top, Cole. Years from now, I think we're going to look back at these women and realize just how lucky we were to watch them compete. That's how talented they are. Here we go, ladies and gentlemen. I don't know who's looking more forward to this, the women in the ring or me. Let's take a moment to discuss Nia Jax. We know she can compete, but how is she going to actually win this thing? And her opponent knows she's going to be tough to beat, but that won't intimidate her. Here it is, table in play. She's flirting with a count out here, guys. Come on, hurry up, get back in there. And she's back in the ring now. One, two, three. Watch out, there's the drop kick. 
There it is. The blatant disregard for the referee's authority gets this one thrown out. What the? I don't think we're going to wait for the match to start. Making his way to the ring from Charlotte. Wait a minute. North we need to get some order back in this. Let's get this thing going. Oh yeah, here's Seth Rollins. Getting taken back to school with the schoolboy right there. Not every move is designed to get the fans off their feet. He's on the defensive here, but he's very aware of who he's in there with and what he has to do to rebound. Two. Three. He's taking damage to the back of the head that render most men completely immobile. Dangerously close to getting counted out. Definitely cutting it close, Michael. Eight. One. Two. Three. Four. Five. Absolutely has to get back in the ring. There's no way around it. Eight. Nine. Ten. Okay, bring them up. The referee has seen enough, and this one is over before it begins. Yeah, the referee just had no other choice. Two. Three. Four. 
Here it is. What a disgusting way to treat a WWE official. This match is tossed out. Making his way to the ring from Fairfield, Connecticut, weighing in at 300 pounds, the WWE Champion, Hartman. Two of WWE's top stars ready to go here in one-on-one -on -one action. This is the match I've been waiting for, guys, ever since it was announced. I've been looking forward to seeing these two clash. And on top of that, this match will undoubtedly have a big impact on where these guys stand in the next WWE.com power rankings. And there's been so much upward movement from new faces over the past few weeks that dropping more than 10 spots following a loss isn't necessarily out of the question. And his opponent, from Pensacola, Florida, weighing in at 210 pounds, Adam Cole. It's time for our first match of the night, guys, and it looks like we have quite the contest coming up. And good luck to those who have to follow this one. You're going to need it. Guys, this match will undoubtedly go a long way in determining just who is the most dominant superstar. That's what makes this match so great. These superstars clearly have a point to prove here tonight and will likely do anything necessary to go ahead and prove that point. It's go time, fellas. These guys are undoubtedly going to give us a show here tonight. As we get started, all the history buffs out there will remember that this city hosted one-third of WrestleMania II back in 1986. Blatant disrespect for the officiating gets this one waved off. 